sweet. Yeah, I haven't worked on the car in weeks. Weeks. I put the firewall, trimmed it all out, measured it, lined it up as it sits. This has been trimmed to this for years. I just never got the chance to cut the tunnel and all that because, of course, I didn't have a transmission. Good thing we didn't because I wouldn't have a turbo 350. Heater core lines are right there. They have to be extended because they only stick out about a half an inch. There's nothing to grab. Um, Right now it's sitting on the frame. You can see the second line. That second line follows the bottom edge of the tube part of the body. Uh, I got a few little problems, nothing crazy. It's only sheet metal. But this actually has a plate inside that I can bolt it to just to hold it there temporarily so I know exactly where it went. Training line is going to hit a little bit. We're going to trim that back. But you can see the curve for the dipstick is nice down there. And the curve over here, it's not too bad. I didn't go crazy trying to follow the exact shape. I sat it on there. I actually measured the whole thing. And then just trimmed it like crazy. I got a little more of a gap on here versus this one, which is like eighth inch. This one's like half inch. But I also just hit the body and knocked it out of whack anyways. Uh, I've done a lot tonight. It's pitch black outside. And I got to go in. I have a bunch of pictures of me um, trimming it out. These are pretty cool. As I said, my body is spaced up one inch. This is a hockey puck machine down. Um, me and my dad made these years ago. That is what separates the frame, well, from the body. See, there's one there. Doesn't fit right now because my ass ends up in the air a little bit. Fiero. But we're going to roll some body lines in that thing soon and, uh, Grind the corners, weld it in, make some reinforce, uh, supports, reinforcements for the inside so it's not just, you know, a piece of metal floating in the air. Um, take the firewall off, connect it to the inside, and uh, get it in the right position and start working on floors. Um, working hard, man, and uh, I'll tell you something after I figure out what's going on tomorrow. I have a big project going on, which is going to give me a lot of hot rod time. All right. Have a good night.